Hey everybody, today I'm here to show you some of my new um, supplies that I got from Michaels. It's the new Recollections Planner line. They have these different notebooks, they have binders that you can put these in that have interchangeable like cloth covers. They have stickers, tabs, um, like the dividers that you would put in the binder for each section, um, stickers like I said, a whole bunch of stuff. But I just picked up a couple notebooks that I thought would go along well with my Erin Condren since as you'll see inside the insides are very similar in color to the Erin Condren. So I got fitness and nutrition, I got menu, I got budget, and I got to do. And I'm going to show you what each one looks like. So I'm just going to zoom in onto the to-do one first. So every single one comes with, a, the first page has a quote on it, kind of similar to the Erin um, Condren. Sorry, my camera's acting up here. Um, so this one says, just get it done. And when you open it, each page has the date, priority, task, and a check mark. So you can write, um, you know, eat, do a list for each day, or you could do like a week. So this could be the week of, you know, March 1st to March 7th, let's say. And then you would write each task that you want to get done, the priority of them, and then check them off as they get done. And then as you can see, they're all different colors, pink, blues, green. So I thought that they would go along really well with the Erin Condren. And the whole book is like this. So that is the to do. I'm just going to zoom out a bit here. My camera doesn't want to zoom properly today. So that's the to do. The budget one is my favorite. And this one again says the key to happiness is choosing joy. And then when you open it up, it goes into the year budget. Let's see if it's going to work this time. So it has the bill and you can list all your bills here and then your bill total for January, February, every single month and then at the bottom you can total it up. So this is for your year budget for bills. Then the next page is budget month of and then it goes into overview. Income, savings, debt payoff and other and it shows your planned and actual amount. You could put your goals there, you could put a quote in that box there if you wanted and then there's notes on the bottom. And then beside that you have bills. So all your bills due that month their budget of how much do you want to budget for that, the actual, the difference in when, how much you paid, and again you can tally it up on the bottom. Then it goes into expenses, and this is where you would write every day when you spend money on coffee or groceries or whatever, you would just put the date, what you spent it on, and the amount. And it gives you three pages per month for that. Then it goes into budget graph, and this is my favorite part. So you can go and you can highlight in your expenses area that I just showed you, how much you spend in each category so you could write down the restaurant and you can graph it so I don't know if you can see this but there's in very faint gray it says 25, 50, 75, 100, 125, 150 so it goes up by $25 all the way up to $400 so you can just if you spent on restaurants $100 you could just color in this bar and then put the total amount spent and it goes groceries, gas, entertainment, shopping, other and a bunch of other categories. So this can show you where you're spending and where you need to cut back. And then it goes on to the next month. And then every month repeats. So it's got the budget, the bills, the three expense pages, and the budget graph. And it goes like that all the way through. And then it has notes pages in the back. About three, let's see, four notes pages. So that's the budget book, and again, that's my favorite one. And then I got this menu one. And again, quote, it says, some of the best things in life are family, friends, and good food. And then it's got a spot for favorite recipes. Appetizers, soups, salads, drinks. Main dishes, desserts, snacks. Then it goes into special occasions, so anytime you're going to have to cook a big meal, you can write that in there. And then it's got your equivalent measurements and notes. And then it goes into a page like this where it has menu and it's got the days of the week down the um, left sidebar and then it's got your week of shopping list. So here you can write Sunday, you could do breakfast, snack, lunch, dinner and then for the all the entire week and then again your shopping list. And every page in here is the same. So it's got your menu and shopping list. 
and then it has one note page on the back. So I thought that would be cool to track my meals and my shopping list. And then my next favorite is this fitness and nutrition. It's got the quote, decide today to make a change. Then you go in, it has a health plan. So it's got your stats and your eight week goals and your reward. Then it's got a notes page. And then it goes into your goals, week of. So it's got your first week's goals by nutrition, exercise, other, and then again your reward, and then it's got the exercise schedule. So Sunday to Saturday, cardio and strength, you can put that in there. And then it's got your daily log. So you can put what you had for breakfast, the amount, and the calories. Same with lunch, dinner, and snacks. Total calorie, calories, it's got your water, your sleep, your notes, your exercise log again for cardio, strength, and duration. So this page is more your goals for the week. And then this would be your daily log. And then you've got enough for seven days. And then again, it goes into, well, sorry, it goes into week review. So you can track how well you did for that entire week in a journal. And then it goes into the next week, your goals for the week. And then seven daily logs. And then it will have the week review right here. And I thought this would be a good way for me to track all my health. And then in the end, it has the notes. And um, that's it for that line. So this is Michael's recollection line and just a few things that I got. I haven't decided if I'm going to keep them in here or if I'm going to actually trim the binding off and put them inside my Kiki K. But I will keep you updated on how they are working and I'm really excited to use them. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thank